yes, hello guys. So, taking on the trend of me doing more like beauty, I guess, related videos. I'm gonna do my post shower routine today. It's pretty simple. Already in my pajamas. <laughs> I shower, do the day, put pajamas on, and then I have to get ready to go to work later. But, uh, I'm gonna start out by plucking my eyebrows because they are disgusting and I haven't been able to go get them waxed. Yay. Thanks, you guys. Love it. If I cry, don't worry. <sighs> also, sneeze a lot. there was a really long hair on my chin. Turns out it was just a dog hair. That's fun. Anyways, they are by no means perfect, but uh, it's just gonna have to work. Wow, I have like a super long eyelash in the inner corner. Oh cool, and then I also have an eyelash over here that's not like curling, it's just sticking straight down. That's why. Why? And now my face looks hella dry. So. We're going to move on to a moisturizer, and this is the Pond's Dry Skin Cream Facial Moisturizer, Rich Hydration, it's hypoallergenic, suitable for sensitive skin, and won't clog pores, and honestly guys, just like a dollop. This stuff goes so far, like... The first time I used it, I used a lot, like, a lot, a lot, and my face was hella greasy for, like, two days, up until I took a shower. That's too much <laughs> for just my forehead. Moisturize everything, you guys. Everything. Now I'm gonna check my tooth because I have an extra tooth and it's uh, really inflamed today. I haven't brushed them yet because it hurt. So I'm sure you guys can see that like my eyes are a different color. One is blue and one, one is gray and one is brown. And my boss yesterday, who hasn't seen me in like a month, looked at me and he was like, Kelly, Kai, you changed your eyes? And then like my supervisor was like, she changed her eyes? Yeah, her eyes look different. And then there's me, and it's just like, yeah, I changed my eyes totally. <laughs> totally changed them, just took them out. God, my hair looks so brown because you can't see the rest of it. I have brown hair now, guys. Surprise! Look, I dyed it. Brown hair. Huh, <laughs> psych, it's actually. <laughs> white <laughs> I 
the bottom pieces the underneath is like hella orange so no matter how much I tone it rude I don't know if I've talked about this yet but I will be doing a comparing toners video for you guys I feel like I use too much leave-in conditioner but like my ends need it, man. This is Way to Grow Leave-In Conditioner with Procuto to fortify the tangle and break against, protect against breakage. You can get it at Ulta, you can get it at Walmart, like... I don't know if my hair cut, but not like a different way just oh. thank you just trimmed because like the back is super long right the back is long but then like you have these super short pieces up here and it's like why man and I try to keep leave-in conditioner off the top just because my hair is already really quite oily. Now, don't yell at me. I can't find my white tooth comb. There it is. Oh. I was going to say I'll just use a hairbrush, but I found it. Yay. So now you just start at your ends and work your way up. This is better for your hair, helps reduce against breakage. And not just when you're putting leave in conditioner through it, like just brushing it in general. Always start at the bottom and work your way up. Don't just try to rip the tangles out. So I am so on the fence about bleaching my hair again. Like, I may just get highlights done so it blends more and it's not just that really harsh line of new growth and then that really harsh line of demarcation. Demarcation is like, I'm going to try to explain it, but I feel like I'll explain it wrong, because I dropped out of beauty school. So, <laughs> it's a band, essentially, all around where, like, it had been colored before, you know? but it didn't bleach it the same essentially like it got a different color when it bleached it it's so weird because I oh <laughs> I have some pieces that like like my front pieces for some reason it looks like they haven't grown that much because <laughs> the new growth isn't as crazy Let me see if I can show you guys the demarcation line. Okay, so you have your new growth, and then this band right here is your line of demarcation. It's just a band you get if it's not. If it's just hair being weird. But like, look at that. The back is like super long, and then it's short. Well, it's short, but it's not as short as the underneath pieces. <laughs> so I just need to get it even up. Oh, and if you're... If you're... <laughs> if you... 
much really like that if you've been keeping up with my job drama I'm applying at another job yeah but if I get that job I will be quitting the other two jobs so Yeet. Yeet. I don't know what's wrong with me. It'll be five days a week. And I'll get Friday and Saturday off. Should my mom stay off so I could actually see her? This video's gonna be super long. Sorry. Trying to put out longer content. <sighs> Anyways, that is my post shower routine. Usually I have music going though and getting distracted and listening to that. <sighs> There's still so many orange pieces. I hate it. So part of me wants to color it again, part of me doesn't. Maybe just highlights. <laughs> I message my hairstylist and be like, yo, if I buy this stuff, can you highlight it? Just to blend it. Because if I do get that other job, I won't have to worry about wearing it up for work because it won't be fast food. So I can actually just leave it down and let it relax and. Because I like how white the pieces are, but I wish more of it was that white. So, yes, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We may still end up reading it to my birthday. Because, yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna say bye, guys. I've been filming for. Oh, only like 20 minutes, that's cool. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. And then I just let my hair air dry. And I usually don't do anything to it, except in those other two get rid of things that you've seen where I curled it. But, uh, that was like the first time in a year <laughs> I had put heat on my hair, so. Cause I wanted to help you up, yay! Really need chapstick. Here. Uh, shiny lips. Put a lip screw on. Lip scrub on. How thin my lips are. This is the um. Indie Beauty Buttercream Antioxidant Lip Scrub. It has sugar, shea butter, sweet almond oil, beeswax, avocado oil, vitamin E oil, butterfume flavoring, and sweetener. Yeet. I hope you guys are liking these like more beauty related videos. I think I made a video talking about how I wasn't going to do those anymore because I'm not good at makeup, but uh, they're fun. And on the days where I do try to dress up on the press, you got it. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. It really helps me know what you guys like to see. And if you don't want to miss my videos in the sporadic upload schedule, turn on that bell. My dogs went out. Anyways, once again, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as you do. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! It's been forever.
ever since I've done that. Oh my gosh.